Celine Dion's surprise Grammy appearance encourages comeback rumors after devastating illness. Dion presented Taylor Swift with the Album of the Year award at the Grammys. It has been just over a year since singer Celine Dion stunned fans by announcing she had been diagnosed with the incurable neurological disorder Stiff Person Syndrome, SPS, forcing her to cancel all foreseeable tour dates. Over the past few months, the Canadian singer has had a resurgence in the limelight, an encouraging sign for fans hoping she'll make a comeback. On Sunday, Dion made a surprise appearance at the 66th Grammy Awards, appearing as the final presenter of the night, announcing the winner for Album of the Year. Thank you all, I love you right back, she told the audience as she received a standing ovation. Before presenting the award to Taylor Swift for her album, Midnights, Dion briefly touched upon the gravity of her appearance. When I say that I'm happy to be here, I really mean it, from my heart. Even more encouraging, Dion just announced her upcoming documentary, I Am, Celine Dion, an intimate look at her world after the life-changing diagnosis. In a press release for the project obtained by SSN24 News Digital, Dion acknowledged her desire to perform again. This last couple of years has been such a challenge for me, the journey from discovering my condition to learning how to live with and manage it, but not to let it define me, Dion said. As the road to resuming my performing career continues, I have realized how much I have missed it, of being able to see my fans. During this absence, I decided I wanted to document this part of my life, to try to raise awareness of this little-known condition, to help others who share this diagnosis. A release date for the documentary, airing on Prime Video, has not been shared. The Grammys was Dion's first public outing since the end of October, when she and her sons attended the Las Vegas Golden Knights game against the Montreal Canadiens. At the time, it was an indication she was immersing herself back into the public. Dion wrote of the experience, My boys and I had such a fun time visiting with the Montreal Canadiens after their hockey game with Vegas Golden Knights in Las Vegas Monday night. They played so well, what a game. Thank you for meeting us after the game, guys. That was memorable for all of us. Have a great season. In November, Dion attended singer Katy Perry's final performance of her Las Vegas residency. She was seen dancing throughout the show, giving fans and officials more confidence she can return to the stage in 2024, wrote columnist John Katsalamides for the Las Vegas Review Journal. After revealing her diagnosis, the My Heart Will Go On singer also made her acting debut, appearing in the 2023 flick Love Again. She recorded a slew of new songs for the soundtrack. Dion actually starred as herself in the film, admitting in a press release that she had a lot of fun doing this movie, which finished filming in early 2021. I think it's a wonderful feel-good story, and I hope that people will like it, and like the new songs too," she continued. Fighting back tears in December 2022, Dion announced her SPS diagnosis in an emotional Instagram video, pre-recorded in both English and French. I've been dealing with problems with my health for a long time. And it's been really difficult for me to face these challenges and talk about everything that I've been going through," she said. Dion detailed the specific problems she had been experiencing, including mobility issues. While we're still learning about this rare condition, we now know this is what has been causing all of the spasms I've been having. Unfortunately, these spasms affect every aspect of my daily life, sometimes causing difficulties when I walk and not allowing me to use my vocal cords to sing the way I'm used to," she said. I'm working hard with my sports medicine therapist every day to build back my strength and my ability to perform again. But I have to admit it's been a struggle. All I know is singing. It's what I've done all my life. And it's what I love to do the most," she expressed at the time. SPS is defined by the Cleveland Clinic as a rare autoimmune movement disorder that affects the central nervous system, the brain and spinal cord. People with this condition first experience a stiffening of the muscles of their trunk followed, over time, by the development of stiffness and rigidity in the legs and other muscles in the body.